Hello guys, good day. Today we will take up the design procedures which are uh, with commonly the LRF, LRFD then the ESD design procedure. So uh, this is not a new difference nila. And LRFD procedure, the capacity of the section uh, member or system is based on the nominal capacity, yung RN which is reduced by applying a resistant factor, yung phi sub n. This gives the ultimate capacity which should not be less than the factored forces on the section member or system. So this is expressed in the equation form below. So isulat natin yung equation natin sa LRFD. Yung tinatawag na phi sub n then yung RA natin must be greater than sa summation of the FI times the QI so ano yung uh, phi N yung phi in natin yan sub N this is the resistant uh, resistance factor for uh, N type force okay so for example uh, tension uh, compressions compressions sorry okay uh, then bending okay Then, how about the Rn? Ano tong Rn na yan? So, yung Rn is the nominal capacity. Cap nominal capacity yan for, uh, para sa uh, n-type na force. Okay. So, depending sa type na force. Okay. Yan, ano naman yung FI? Yung FI na yan is the load factor. Load factor for load type I natin. Okay. Then the QI, this is the load. Ito yung load QI natin. Okay. Then, uh, yung tinatawag na alternative design procedure naman is called the allowable strength design. So, next tayo. Okay. So, ang tinatawag daw na allowable strength design, so this is the alternative design procedure. So, yung allowable, allowable, strength design. So, wag yung kalimutan, ito yung katandaan nyo, yung strength. Okay, based in strength tayo. Strength design, this is the alternative uh, design procedure. Design procedure. Okay? Then, which will herefore be referred to as ASD? So, ito na yung tinatawag na ASD natin. This is the ASD. Based on the abbreviation, ito. This is the ASD. Pero, uh, hindi to yung ASD na old na uh, design procedure. Okay? So, in this procedure, the capacity is determined by dividing the nominal capacity, Rn, with a factor of safety, the omega omega n this reduced capacity is not to go below the service loads or forces this is illustrated uh, in equation below so isulat ko yung formula naman ng ISD natin yung ISD natin is the R Rn uh, the ratio of Rn over the mu n so, okay. must be greater than siya sa summation of QI Okay. So, ito yung pang 
formula natin para sa ASD. Ano naman yung mu na yan? So, mu naman, ito yung safety uh, factor uh, for N type force. Okay? Ayun. So, yun ang pagkakaiba ng uh, dalawang design procedures na yan. Then, huwag yung kalimutan, uh, ito pala yung meaning ng LRFD is the load resistance factor design. So, ano natin? Yung meaning nila, yung LRFD. So, this is the load and resistance factor design. Okay? Then, the ESD, this is the allowable strength design. Okay? So, yun ang pagkakaiba ng uh, dalawang design procedure natin. Then, this is the uh, abbreviation or the meaning of the abbreviation ng design procedure natin na LRFD, that is the load and resistance factor design then ESD naman yung allowable strength design okay, yun lang guys so sa next video natin i-discuss natin yung load combination based sa NSCP uh, section ng NSCP kung saan natin makikita okay, yun lang guys, thank you and God bless